I'm just going to vacuum up all the dirt and stuff out of that pan. It makes it a lot easier to start seeing what I'm looking at. Okay, I got my vacuum cleaner and cleaned this all off. I'm going to go ahead and set my battery in here. Um, this car has an electric fuel pump on it here. I don't know if it works or not, but it's a good way to find out is to hook it up. I've got a uh, small portable gas tank back here that Dead Eye Dan gave me, and I will uh, set it. Where's my gas tank? It's supposed to be sitting right in here somewhere. I know it can't have gone far. Oh, uh, here it is, right there. So I'll set it up on front, that way I'm using that pump and that line to make sure it's all good. I've got a uh, <clears throat> gauge board here that came off an old generator that my neighbor had in the dump, and it's got an ignition switch on it. I was thinking, well, I can use that ignition switch to, uh, you know, just take this gauge board over here and lay it lay it or place it over here so that I can literally sit in my seat and reach over and flip this switch crank it that should work uh, and then uh, <clears throat> I can set a seat in here where I can work the pedals and go ahead and get my brake lines and everything fixed and then uh, probably have to make a little bracket to mount my steering wheel up on once I do that though I can let this down and drive it around which is what I want to do uh, I want to get this engine running. I want to see if this carburetor is right or if it's too much for this motor. I want to put the fan shroud back on here, put the alternator on it, wire the alternator so that it's charging, and uh, make sure everything's good to go. I've got to change this exhaust manifold because this particular one wouldn't fit. And this one is also leaky. And a lot of these bolts are oh, they're pretty eat up by rust, so I'm going to have to try and carefully get them off without you know ruining these bolts that go into the head here and if I do ruin them I'll have to drill them out so I got quite a lot of work to do you know to get this where I want it before I put the body on it and of course I'm going to fix these rust holes put those new pans in there and paint everything go all over everything clean everything up so it's a good place to start and it's kind of fun work uh, Unlike dragging bodies around and moving them from here to there, I finally get to do something where I get to hear the motor run a little bit. That'd be kind of cool. So I'll get on with it.